Computers are an integral part of our life. They are, they are our friends for this life. And same a computer can also harm us. And computer vision syndrome is one of the problems that is rising in the IT industry. Let's find out why computer vision syndrome happens. One of the major things is because a person who is concentrated on a computer and his work does not blink as frequently as a normal person. A normal person blinks around 10 to 15 times per minute. And a person who watches the computer intently blinks only 2 or 3 times a minute. Because the blink rate is very less, the wetting of the eye is poor. Because the wetting, eye is poor, wetting of the eye is poor, there are problems associated with oxygen supply to the eye. The other problem is, a person who is sitting in an AC room has a higher rate of drying of the cornea. The third thing which we can modify is the height of the monitor. In a normal office situation, this is the placement of the monitor. If a monitor is placed at eye level, if you see the, my eye, the white part of the eye is more exposed. If the more part of the eye is exposed, more amount of drying happens to the eye. As opposed to when I am seeing a laptop, my upper eyelid comes down and the exposed part of the eye is very less. So the drying effect on the eye is very less. There are many things we can do to prevent computer vision syndrome. The most effective is to remember to blink your eye. Because when you blink your eye, there is a fresh layer of tears that are coating the cornea. The cornea does not have any blood supply. So the oxygen supply to the cornea is dependent on atmospheric oxygen. Ox atmospheric oxygen. A cornea that is wet and not dry has a greater oxygen transmissibility. What can we do to prevent computer vision syndrome? The most effective is to remember to blink frequently. Because the moment we blink, a fresh layer of tears come on our cornea. The tears are very important for the cornea because the cornea does not have any blood supply. And the oxygen comes from the atmospheric oxygen. And a wet cornea is very essential for the oxygen to diffuse into the eye. The second thing is, if you are in AC room, you are concentrating intently on the monitor. After some time, our focus is fixed at the monitor. And if you try to look at a distant subject, we can immediately know that it is not focused for us. That is because our vision is fixed for the monitor. To avoid that, every 20 minutes, spare 20 seconds in focusing on a far object. That is a 20-20 rule. For every 20 minutes of computer work, keep 20 seconds to look at far objects so that the focusing lock is broken. The third thing is, we can adjust the placement of the monitor like I mentioned. We can reduce it from the eye level around 25 degrees lower, then the exposed part of the eye is lesser, so the drying is lesser, so more oxygen enters the eye and we can be free of computer vision syndrome.